Hey all, this is Zerst, and welcome back to our Huge Earth TSL starring Lenin. And welcome back to the Second Great War for Chinese Liberation, as we have determined to call it from the arts of our propaganda department. Yep, we're still kicking their butt. Uh, like I said, I took care of a lot of administrative stuff off screen and let the turn turn over so we can get right back to the action here. Let's go. Okay, so it looks like Jin Yang is getting a little feisty with his defensive troops, and if I want to be safe, I'm going to need to pull back a bit. Hal, I think, is going to be ours this turn, so I'm not going to waste too much time with that. I'm going to bombard the ever-living snot out of it right there, like so. And in so doing, I'll probably make it vulnerable for our city attackers. Let's see, you're a land attacker, so you're no fun, but you're a... Yeah, you're a city attacker. You can do this pretty easy without dying. Still good. Eight damage to halt. Really? You can't do any better than that. Oh, air repair. Booyah! I knew I was doing this for a reason. Uh, yeah, you need to do more work on Hall here. Yeah, no. We're, we're breaking even, but that's not really good. All right, air repair on you. Fabulous. Oh, you can do more damage. 20 and 10. As you can see, aircraft do less damage. They're injured too, so BT dubs. But now, basically, our infantry can do this. Our infantry can take Halt and then be done with it. So let's use our weakest infantry to take Halt. Hi. Fantastic. We will ultimately annex Halt, so I'm actually going to annex it immediately so we get the free courthouse. We can take the happiness hit, I'm sure. Uh, but now we can actually work this territory in a big way and be optimal about everything so the good thing now is that we can send our infantry forward to break more stuff like that and we can use the already present road network to make a good front line if we were on said road network so kind of bummer we're not but we also need another worker out here which is kind of funny come to think of it i haven't really thought about getting more workers but now i will so we can repair all these roads and get our road networks running up and over okay so my cup runneth over we have taken how in a big way so one, two, we can kill this guy with our cav, I think. Yeah, go one, two, yep. And we have March, so we can just get right back here and do good that way. Look, there's a couple things coming in there. Going to try to retake Howl, but we should be able to hold it down. Ji uh, Quan Chu is also a potential threat. I'm going to keep my Lancer here, just so I can run out, pillage, and get the hell back. I want to keep this line pretty strong. I don't want to risk actually losing anything important. Looks like we've pincered their forces in. If we can take Jinyang, then it's going to be so much easier to attack north, uh, which was the plan initially. So, yay for plans coming together. Don't you love it when that happens? If that isn't an A-team reference, I don't know what is. Okay. So Jinyang, uh, I would really like to take Jinyang, but I can't safely. What I am going to do, though, is move some of these guys to haul uh, these devious, devious bombers that we have, and we'll be able to use them against the forces near Jinyang uh, with our air repair, give them a little bit of time to repair so they're not getting too hard, and then we can actually use them in our front lines, and things will be better. What is this? Yeah, the other guys took the city down, so we're not going to be able to use them anytime. So how do we do this best? We can move one of these guys out. I just want to make sure this guy does not kill my infantry. So what probably going to do is pull these guys out to friendly territory. Bomb Jin Yang some more and put another infantry in this guy's place. That's probably the best thing at this point. Um, just long enough to hold out, basically. So we can take it with the Lancer or something, and then we can move in. Because we're also going to be moving in from the north here. Once our airplanes are... On route, we should be fine. So, yeah, let me do that. Let's take this guy out here to heal. Uh, we need to keep vision. Do you still have movement? Oh, you do. Okay, so let's do this right. Come here to heal. Come here to heal. You're going to come in here to hold the line. And then you have double cover, too, so it'll be even easier to deal with. And then you're going to beat the crap out of Jin Yang. Oh, you weren't set up. That's right. We moved you away last time. Okay, Jin Yang is down to red. Which means we should be able to get it pretty close with our aircraft and stuff. I'm thinking now, have we over infantry this position? We may have, but yeah, we have over infantry this. Let's bring one infantry forward this way. The rest can handle the rest, as they say. All right, let's crank this out. This cannon is not long for this world, obviously. So let's maul that. How close are we actually knocking Yan Chi down? Are we ready to take it yet? I don't think we are, but we're pretty damn close. 
Yeah, almost. Probably another round of artillery fire will do it, so. Yeah. Yeah. And then we're going to take this land for Kashlik. We're just going to annex Yan... We're not going to annex Yanchi, sorry. We're going to leave it puppeted. Then we're probably going to annex Kashgar so we can use this. Oh, no, we use it with Pingyang. So, yeah, we're probably going to annex... I mean, gee, I keep saying that. Puppet Kashgar as well and annex Pingyang and take all the good tiles like we were planning. So, that's really the main thrust here. So Yanchi's down in a turn. Let's not waste time. Let's kill this cannon. A little more oomph. And then you can keep healing because you're... Ah, I got cover two now. So it'll be even easier. All right, free archaeologist. What am I going to do with you? Oh, we probably get open borders with the Goths right now since they allegedly are friendly with us, which is really weird. How much for your open borders, friend? Oh, we have open borders with you? We do! Ah, oh, I must have done that in between turns. I totally forgot because I was trying to get back to the war. Uh, well, right. Well, that means we can try and steal this piece of cultural heritage out from under him, so let's do that. We do do that a lot. Hearts and minds, baby. Hearts and minds. Who got promoted? Oh, you got promoted. Oh, cool. We have another artillery to do work. Uh, let's... What do we promote the last one into? Let's make another... Is this a rough one? This is a rough one. Let's do a rough one here. And then we're gonna move out probably... Ah, we could totally use a pillage here. Let me get on that real quick. I don't want anything to come out of Kashgar and kill me. My uh, artillery specifically. So why don't we move you here? Yep. And then we're going to roll this guy back onto the road, roll you here, and set you up to bombard the crap out of Kashgar next turn. So far, so good, actually. This is looking really nice. Uh, do I need this Lancer anywhere? Maybe to take the city so my infantry can do other stuff. Let me bring you one tile closer, just for giggles. All right. Future Lincoln ended Marble Lincoln. Is Lincoln dead? No, remarkably so. Hey, buddy. Strong economy, I know. I'm just that good. You have no money and minus 25 gold per turn. I ain't selling you diddly, bucko. What can we fire? Oh, look at this! Oh, he's got friends. Isn't that cute? Oh, he actually did something. Aw, oh, that's so nice. He's, it's nice to see someone trying hard. Such a try hard, this guy. All right, we could probably kill him. Let me do it this way because it's getting irritating. All right, you're fine there. You can let this fire on the Lancer and maybe we can kill it with just a shot from you. You yeah, should be fine. We should get him here. Bingo! No pillaging. No muss, no fuss. Alright, hi. Bye. That's done. Any other ships to kill? I did manage to kill a frigate earlier. Was, hey, there's another one. Whee! Alright, more Chinese ships to kill. What else do we have? Hey, another frigate. Whee! This is how frigates deal with submarines. Answer, they don't. Malacca. Whee! All right. Submarine experience. Annoying sound effects to the side. That's, that's pretty good. We got two growths as well. Moscow, beautiful. I want our capital to be as big and bloated as possible. Um, yeah, let's keep growing primarily. It's 10 turns versus 10 turn. Really? No, no faster. All right. Well, let's get more production out of it then. I'm not going to say no. Uh, is yes, the best tile? Yes, yeah, the best tile for production right now. Okay, that works for me. And military base medical lab, and then we'll start cranking out probably another air wing over here to deal with our west, just in case something weird happens. Uh, speaking of other things to build, Hall, yeah, we did, <laughs> we did kind of annex you, didn't we? All right, now we can queue up things to build for all the joy that's going to give us. Let's start with a monument, university. Yeah, how about we do that for now, and then we'll talk. Okay, pumpkin. Yeah, you're going to be in resistance for eight turns, so I don't know what we're going to do with that. Uh, oh, cool. We finished a stadium in Kashlik. All right, cool. How much... Do we need more artillery at this point, practically speaking? I don't think we do. I could crank out another one, but I think we're actually doing quite all right with what we've got. We're going to upgrade to rocket artillery relatively soon. So I think Kashlik can start building another air wing. Yeah, let's start up on some triplanes. Let's get this rolling, and we'll get some bombers going, too. Probably bombers first at this point. I need a defensive air wing up here. But just in case he suddenly gets aircraft, let me start with a triplane. <laughs> Watch me be paranoid! News at 11. All right. Uh, what can we do with you? New things to build here. Kashlik. Right. Didn't I just queue something up for you? I probably did, but I forgot. So let's do a triplane here. What the... Wait, wait. Where, where, where are we building the other airplane for? Hold the phone. Oh, and Young Cheng. Oh, you're all done building everything? Yeah, you're not... Ugh, there we go. That's what I meant to do. And Kashlik is the one supposed to be building the airplane stuff. Yes, okay, that's correct now. 
<sighs> Alright, and Chang'an group. So we can drop... Um, we're already staffing everything, so production probably wouldn't be bad. So let's do that. Yep. Sounds good to me. Uh, we can turn it into a farm, actually. We need to do that at some point. Anyway, sorry. I digress. I don't digress. I aggress. Stay here. And we should be fine there. This will take the city. No probsies. Alright, good. All coming in going according to plan. Do we not have on boards with the... Oh, we do have boards with the Australians. I want to heal this in friendly territory just for a little bit. Uh, just so we can. He's a little vulnerable at the moment. Alright, good. Gatling gun. You need to be machine guns where I can use it in the front. These cities are way too damn strong. You get blown up. Warrior, damn it, move. I've been here for seven generations. I could really use a little bit of cooperation here. Alright, I guess they really like the archaeology site. You have March, so there's really no need to worry about you. Let's roll you up here. We'd probably use you for something good. Uh, like stealing stuff and pillaging. So let's wait you there. Brothers of Color War and Alaric. Who the hell is at war with these guys? That's a good question. Who is at war with Alaric? Uh, yeah, you're at war with the Garamantes. You're at war with the Karal. Garamantes and Sibir. So I guess the Garmantes are the ones... Okay, Garmantes are actually at war with people, but they're not, obviously not doing much. Okay. Oh, that's what happened to Brussels. Damn it, Garmantes. Stop doing this crap. Like, seriously. 23. Here's a grand. Stay with me. I need my culture. Daddy likes his culture. Okay? Move the best. Let me start buying another city state off here just because you're being an ass. kind of feel like I should. But anyway, the big, the big uh, story here now, though is that the great scientist bulbing numbers, they have more or less leveled out. So I'm going to start bulbing these dudes, and we're going to get like a crap ton of technologies uh, in about 2.5 seconds. It's going to be absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing. So I'm going to try to give a good balance by first getting satellites after atomic theory, just to make sure we get those two extra scientists, then bulb up to the internet, and then we'll fill in uh, just so we can keep our tourism backup victory going. So you know what? Let's Let's enjoy this while we can. Great scientist, where are you? All my civilian units. There we go. We got, we got six of you to bull. Well, it's going to be sexy. All right, Enrico Fermi, discover tech. We got ballistics. As you can see, we didn't actually get that much science for that. I guess because the costs increased that much, so not too wild. Uh, all right, let's go here. Gregor Mendel, we discover something new. Electronics, now we have battleships. How cute is that? We're going to need some oil for that, too, after the next air wing. So that's another investment that's coming in. We do have to get some more oil. i got to figure out another way. Yeah, the Goths have some up there. The Khan does, but I don't really want these crap cities just for the oil. I don't know. I'm getting a lot of aluminum. That'll be better, actually, in the long run. We'll have upgraded aircraft before long. All right, anyway, another scientist. Uh, Zhu Chongji. Yeah, atomic theory. Okay. We got some uranium. All right, we got one there by Chang'an. How many sources do we have? Got one by Apulon. Oh, we have six sources of uranium. Oh, I smell GDRs in the future. It's going to be glorious. All right, we got to remember where these are, or we put workers on them right now. Let me jot this real quick, uh, just like I did last time with the archaeology site. So southwest of Chang'an, uh, we got northwest of Apulon. What else do we have? We have northwest of B. And northeast of Howe. Oh, I'm glad I took that city. And northwest of Moscow, which is not workable, but it's still uranium. Okay, and the last one. We got northwest of Minsk. Awesome. All right, that is a lot of sources of uranium, and it's gonna, it's gonna be huge. Wow, beautiful. Okay, well that was better than I expected to be, actually. Makes me very happy. Okay, now we're building a little more, I think. So what do we said we do? We push for satellites, I think. So let's push radar, upgraded aircraft. Oh, that'd be nice too. Let's keep bulbing. Uh, where are you, buddy? Where's my scientist at? All right, I gotta do this the hard way. I kind of thought I'd see them. I spread them out all over. I'm sure why I keep them by like a damn capital. Rainy Dekau. Radar. Sweet. All right. So we'll probably take a turn and upgrade these aircraft before long so we can hit a little more range tactics going. Can we do that this turn, actually? No, no, we can't. Uh, all right. Radar. We're going to have rocket artillery shortly, which is going to be beautiful. We're in our Heisenberg. 
Hi, rocketry. And we're gonna get satellites. So let's build that last one. Great scientist. Named great scientist. Information error, baby. We beat Monty to it. Sexy! Alright, awesome. I love it. Uh, yes, yeah, Sky Signal's alien. Okay, LBJ. Belongs to the people who prepare for it today. Yes, indeed. Uluru, we have discovered. Cerro de Botosi, we have discovered. Mount Kilimanjaro, we have discovered. Lake Victoria, we kind of know where all these are. We just haven't gotten around to seeing them. But that's six more happiness, and we're 153 after taking a couple cities, so booyah. No more natural wonders to be discovered. We know all the secrets of the world, little beast. And a spy has been recruited. Yuri. Oh, that's awesome. I hope he's a psychic spy. There's only one, Yuri. Mr. Prime Minister. Oh, sorry, I, I'm, I'm loving the old school Red Alert reference right there. It's glorious! Alright, let's get <laughs> Hubble Space up. And I want airports right after Hubble Space as well. We need to crank out them's tourisms a little more. So first of all, hurry production on the Hubble. So we have two more scientists to bulb. Sexy. So now we have satellites and we're in the information era. We're going to push to the internet. Get ecology, telecom for nuclear subs, and then extra tourism, and then we'll backfill. This is actually not all going to be in one turn, by the way. It's going to eventually go away. This will be in one turn. Telecom may be in one turn. Internet will not be. But we'll have a couple more bulbs for that. So, booyah! All right, and Yuri, where can we send Yuri? Uh, where, where can we send Yuri, actually? Probably to a city state that we want. Unless we want to make Yuri schmooze and mind control some people elsewhere. Where's Yuri? I'm going to keep doing that. I'm sorry. Uh, who do we need for tourism? I guess we can schmooze the Chinese that would kick the crap out of them, but... Not really going to be a necessity, I think. Let's see. We're already in Benin. We could go to the Caral to speed that along. We could go to Harappa to speed that along. Let's go to Harappa to make it a little easier. The Garamantes, did they have a bigger pool? 61 versus 60. And, and the Harappa doesn't have as much tourism pressure since they are freedom ideology, I think. Yeah. Okay. So we're going to toss them into into Harappa, I think. You're going to schmooze with Harappa, buddy. Yuri, mind control our southern subjects. Where are you? There we go, Harappa. The capital, I think, is Harappa. <laughs> Harappa's the capital of Harappa! All right, excellent. Now I'll have Brussels. I know, I'm that good. Okay, we have a bunch of money. I'm going to save some of this for priority upgrades since we already jumped way up there. Uh, I'm going to... Prioritize aircraft and artillery, and then I think we can start backfilling the Gatling guns. A lot of backfilling going on. I think it's my new word of the day. Backfill. All right. Hey, Naifu is there. My Naifu. And we can see where all the cities are. Holy crap. Oh, look. The Garmadis have a crap city over here, mainly because they saw the uranium. Cheating bastards. Oh, and the oil. Okay. Interesting. So, yeah, Monty's going to push for these... Aussie cities, but luckily we have a pretty big buffer. What I do want to do is push Monty off of Japan, which I think I can do pretty comfortably right now. And am I going to get any really good strategics for this? Ah, extra coal. That's a lot of coal to sell. I guess we sell it to Harappa. Oh yeah, five more oils. That's not bad. And basically we'll make it harder for Monty to get here. He'll have to go through the ocean, which will be very hard for him to do. So this is going to be my next target uh, once we go to war. But we don't need to explore anymore. Chuvash Cafe. Oh, K Kate. <laughs> That'd be awesome to have a city named Chuvash Cafe, wouldn't it? All right, and let's see how much work he did in South America. Yeah, Monty did some work here. But yeah, look how close the AI settles cities. It's really kind of disturbing. I don't know. It's never not really optimal. This can, this shouldn't happen. One, two, three. No, he should not have been able to settle the city. That's a glitch. Can't settle uh, within three tiles. That, I mean, you can do it over coast. Potato on the potal. Damn it! I'm misreading everything, but it's funnier that way. So let me do it. Okay. Wow. All right. Well, Monty is as big as we thought he was, but it looks like the Boers are doing pretty well here. The Garamantes, yeah, they were a little spread. Surprised, actually. And he actually did end up settling a dumb city here. Okay. That's funny. But we do have a couple antiquity sites we can steal, so we do have a spare archaeologist we just captured, didn't we? We'll have to utilize him. Sorry about the slow loading times in the background. It's just, like I said, game is big right now. Computer having trouble. All right, well, well, we'll decide what to do with this archaeologist later, but for now, that's really awesome. Uh, we all know now everything. Go here so we can actually upgrade you, since you don't need you to explore anymore. It was fun while it lasted, though, wasn't it? Infantry is good. All right, I think we can go next turn pretty comfortably. I will see you all then.
All right, and we are back, and it looks like we got us some Hubble, baby. Yeah! All right, we got Ecology. Telecom's coming up. We have basically a little whale to go still, but we got two new scientists, so yay! All right, artillery. Got upgraded. Uh, we're going to do some serious artillery upgrading soon. Starting with our aircraft, though. I need to prioritize a lot of things here, actually. So let's do this step by step. Get accuracy on that one because we've been doing this for a while. I need to keep this guy moving. But still available to upgrade if need be. Can I do that here? Yeah, I can. Okay. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do with you yet. So hold the phone. Choose host. Me! Because I have more votes than anyone else, please. Thank you. Yes, yes, yes. Do it again. Yes. All right. Excellent. It looks like we have international games maybe coming up soon. Uh, I'm not sure when. But we have promotions. Oh, sexy. Air repair. Give me more of those, please. Give me more of the. Uh, almost. Triple. That's pretty good. What else we got? Air repair. Oh. It's like my birthday. All right. Cover two. What else we got? Air repair. Okay. That is just. Amazing. Okay, let's do the city gross because this is easy. Uh, gosh, like, fine there. We'll make more roads. I mean, farms. You know what I mean? Uh, chimgitura, chimgitura, chimgitura. Set up. And. Gothi Skanza. Uh, we were, yeah, we're plugging in. Oh, we're plugging in production, but now we don't have any production to plug in. So, I guess we're going to put you there. Okay. Good enough. Done. All right, step by step. Oh, what? Seriously? So the one city state that the Australians cannot hold on to has once again joined their erstwhile ally in war. Son of a gun. Seriously. Freaking Vilnius. All right. Uh... Ah, damn it, Lithuania. Stop pissing me off. You know, I know you're in, like, Southeast Asia and things are confusing right now, but still, not cool, man. Not cool, bruh. Okay, I guess we have to kill all these bastards, too. Uh, come here. The cannon's no biggie. I'll probably be able to kill the gap pretty easy. Wow, that can be annihilated. All right, let's get the experience, then. Experience there, and kill you with city. Okay, problem solved. Looks like Vilnius really was worth it. Okay, well, they'll lose some units. We'll get some experience. No problems. We have a lot of money, I know. But all of this is going to be going to upgrade soon. I mean, friendship with the Karal has expired. Can we do that again? Hey, buddy. Want to be friends? Yeah. You want to be friends. That's good. Now, our buddies are back. Brussels Quest units. Don't care. An enemy archaeologist is near. Oh, no. Whatever shall I do? I guess extract things for culture and stuff. All right. We're going to surround these guys with the infantry, I think. Oh, we can move on enemy roads because we're based on levees. Oh, that's amazing. That's right. We can use enemy roads now because we're Soviets and we do that. Sick. Okay, let's hit Jinyang a bit. So this is this is basically dead Jinyang right now. Except for this Lancer, actually. This may not be dead Jinyang. That's irritating. All right, so we got to find a way to do this. I might have put just enough units to piss me off here. Let's see. Well, you guys are active. and you, Oh, you're land attackers. No, we'll be fine. How far can you reach? Oh, you can reach all the way there. Ah, we're fine. We're fine. We're good. We're dandy, even. Bombard that. Now, I'll upgrade you guys into real bombers shortly, but first you need to do something for me. Hey, man, I need to talk to you about something. You got no credit? You got bad credit? No problem. My name is Mark, and you can count on If you don't know what that is, I don't know. Check out, I think it's the YouTube hash is the real senior card gauge. If you don't know what that is, you should watch more Homestar Runner. Shit is epic. Anyway, uh, we have open boards with the Goths, and we saw a little something I wanted to steal up here. Yeah, I want to steal that. So you go there, buddy. Oh, no, you're already going there. What the hell am I doing? You go there. Steal that. Where's the archaeologist that's told to move? Damn it. Not you. No. I don't want to put you. I want to put you somewhere else. I want to put you right there. That's where I want to put you. Can you not move there? Hello. Wakey, wakey. Okay, he can go here, but any further is anathema, apparently. Let him be anathema. Okay, apparently that's really hard for him to comprehend. So let we go... How about we go five tiles and we'll go from there. Okay, Blakey? All right, there we go. Finish artillery. Uh, airport. You know what I'm probably going to do is go around and get airport everywhere. It was a recycling center. That wouldn't hurt. Uh, probably a good idea. Let me do that real quick. 
Because it will be quick. All right, I talked to you already. We're fine. Let's go through our cities and put airports everywhere. We already have that here. Our recycling center is going to be in there too, but that's not a priority because we have a lot of aluminum already. Pietagrad, give me airport, medical lab, recycling center, stadium, or something like that. Good. Karkov, airport, after the medical lab, please. And then recycling center. Obviously, you can only make five recycling centers, so, you know, them's the breaks, but all right. Simbirsk. Airport after Neutronstein. Cool. Iskar, we're fine. We get up airport there already. Damn, we're good. Uh, give me this first. I don't need the other air wing that urgently. Airport is fine. Let's do it before the stadium. We don't need having this right now. Airport is fine. Let's put it right at the military base. Airport. Oh, medical lab and stadium aren't queued up here yet. Yeah, about that. Do that first. Lugo id est luceo. Any of these really important? Let's do the tourism stuff, Ray. Let's do the tourism stuff first. Be more important. Good. Narbo. Wow, we have a lot of stuff to queue up. Can we prioritize this in some way? Let's do it after the broadcast tower. That's fine. I'll live with that. Toulouse. Airport after the broadcast tower. Works for me. Zhenyang. Yeah, we got a lot of stuff we can do. Oh, we can do a solar plant here. Sweet. That's oh, right. We're in the middle of the desert. That makes sense. So definitely solar plant, definitely that, definitely that. And let's prioritize the airport right at the military academy. Works for me. Yang Cheng, uh, airport. Feng, airport. Priority and then medical lab at the end. Good, okay, we can do a lot of things here. <laughs> it's still a castle and military academy, damn. Do that after the police station, then we'll talk. This is gonna be a lot of gold maintenance. Airports are expensive to maintain, so are recycling centers. But it's worth it in the end. The tourism boost we're going to get is going to be astronomically large. It's going to be huge. It'll be awesome. And we can fit more aircraft in all our cities. So, yay. Do that first. Don't need that stadium yet. All right. And we'll do... We'll figure out how when we get around to it. But right now... Oh, wait. We can do this right, first of all. Let's... Manual specials control. Production focus. Reset. And then we'll talk once we're ready to do something with you. Yeah? Okay? Okay. That's good. All right, sorry about that. No, I'm not I'm sorry about that at all. That was necessary. What am I talking about? Why am I apologizing for good tactics? I should never apologize for good tactics. Only good judgment. So we can take Zhenyang now. Let's take Zhenyang now. Yes? Yes. Hey. So Zhenyang, we're probably going to annex two. It's a nice city. I like to have it. Thank you. We can turn the molten into very productive parts of the empire after we reorganize everything with our workers, but that's more than worth it. Now we got to clear up all these things so they don't retake the city. They may retake the city, actually. They may play a little bit of uh, keep away here, which is annoying, but we can easily just take it right back. Uh, can we line some of these things? We can. Oh, we could, these are our roads now, so we can totally do this. We can eliminate some cannons. Yeah, it's going to be a little hard to do this, but I think we still pull it off. How far can we move our cab? Okay, we can do our cab pretty well. Roll our cab there. Seriously? God freaking damn it. Really? That's what that's what happens now with our cavalry? Alright. Uh, let's go kill you then, I guess. So it might bait him into doing something else. Uh, let's do this for now. That's really annoying, actually. <laughs> I kind of thought the cav... I got a really bad calculation on that. Um, can we kill... No, we can't kill that guy. Damn it! Alright. Uh, you need to upgrade. You need to upgrade, too. You can go this way, I guess. We can do something about this guy. This guy's really sitting here just taunting me for some reason. Not sure why. He likes to taunt. Hey, buddy. Alright. Well, I guess we're just going to sit back and hope Zhenyang doesn't get retaken because that would suck. Uh, well, There's really not much I can do here, actually. Except just hope it doesn't get burned down. It may. With two cannons and a great war infantry, it may get burned down. Um, Hopefully the courthouse won't go away. Kind of a bummer. All right, well, not much I can do. I'm just going to keep pushing. No sense overthinking it. Yan Chi is going to go down, and we're going to puppet this one, like I said. Oh, we still have the aircraft, right? We can do some work with that, so maybe we'll be fine. All right, Yan Chi is down, so let's get an infantry in there. And you're going to puppet, just because I don't really want you to do anything feasible, and Kashi is going to claim all your territory now. How bad is the puppet dying right now? He's starving. You're no longer starving. Okay, yeah, you have a lot of fruitful territory I'm going to steal. So, Koshlik, steal all that territory you can. Good. All right. And we can move you somewhere. This is pretty good. I like that tile. I'm going to use it. Okay, Yanchi is still going to grow, despite my best efforts. So, cool. 
Well, that's done. Uh, now we can move into Kashgar and get a stronger position here. Can we kill the cannon? We can, but then we won't be able to get back out. So let's table that for now. We're going to put you there. Okay, let's put you right here. We're going to take a shot with you. Uh, yeah, we won't be able to upgrade all these artillery at once, so that's all right. And let's... Should we even bother... Well, we'll have to repair this road anyway, so let's do this. That's one pillage. That's another pillage. And let's go back out so you can't reinforce quickly. So the noose is tightening, and the Chinese probably feel it at this point. They may try to retake Jinyang. If they're, well, if they're stupid, they'll try to hit my infantry. If they're smart, they'll try to retake the city, which they likely will. They tend to focus on cities. All right. Now, that being said, where are our bombers? Oh, we already did this, didn't we? And we can't do much with you guys. Yeah, so we're going to upgrade these guys into proper bombers. So we can now. They have air repair, so this will be much easier to do. Okay, perfect. Do we have a worker in here? Oh, we just bought one. Right, man. All right, let's put you right there and repair everything so we can connect the city and do a couple other things. That first of all. Uh, okay, then we'll upgrade these guys at some point. So let's start upgrading the artillery we can upgrade. Move one tile and upgrade. It's going to be so much aluminum, but it's going to be worth it. Rocket artillery are the shiznit. All right. Uh, any other artillery that are actually available for upgrade right now? Artillery, nope. Pretty much everything is either great, everything's grayed out or already upgraded. So, yeah. Well, we will save the money for next turn. I'm not going to burn it on anything else right now. I could use a couple machine guns, I guess, but that's later. That is later, man. Yeah, I'll set you up there for now. Great general, name is Great General. And we'll see what happens here. It will likely be a retaken city. I'm kind of sad about that, but well, let's queue up a monument for now. We'll talk. But we'll see. Uh -huh. Two great scientists. Right, we're going to bulb out telecom and internet, so let's do that. Telecom, nuclear submarines. We'll bulb out the internet, too. Booyah! All right, so now we have double tourism, which is going to help a lot. I have 100 great work slots available. Me thinks we're not going to be able to fill that. <laughs> it's just one of those just one of those suppositions I have. Me thinks it's not going to happen. Oh, you can go to an ironclad. We still have coal? Yeah, we do have still have coal. Holy crap. Okay, well, let's do that for now. I know I said I wouldn't be spending money on stupid stuff, but I kind of like ironclads. I never have enough of those, even though you always have enough because they're not really that particularly good. Can you heal here? You can heal here, uh, but you can't upgrade in unfriendly territory. So why don't we just bring you... Well, Chinese might kill you, actually, if I'm not careful. So let's heal you up first, then we'll send you back. All right, choose research. All right, we got the internet. So now we can backfill bits and pieces that we want. I could go combustion for destroyers. I'm going to want to do that. How much research do we have? 65. Okay, that's how much we bulbed extra. So we can pretty much get one extra bulb on something. Uh, we could we could get mobile tactics. That would give us mobile infantry. That would be just the death knell of a lot of things. Let's do that. Oh, we can only get nuclear fission. Ah, crap. That's all right. Let's get nuclear fission. We'll move to mobile tactics, then we'll go back this way. We, this way, we could also potentially get advanced ballistics. Actually, let's hold on. Let's get nuclear fission for now. <laughs> it says the guy who can't even afford to upgrade all his Gatling guns into machine guns, but you know you know my thinking, right? Uh, what thinking? You're not thinking. You're probably right. All right. Go right here. Set that up. Railroad. Great general. Yeah. We need you to stay kind of right there for the moment. This could be problematic with Jin Young, but whatever. It'll be less unhappiness, I guess, in the end, so... I've seen worse things happen. Uh, okay, go here and give me a little bit of railroad. Excellent. You. Where were you going? Oh, you were moving up this way, huh? Well, let's get you to Lukko, I guess, and we'll continue the railroad in the other direction. Sounds good to me. What else we got? We got you continuing this railroad down here. Beautiful. And this way. I like how the war is not really affecting the fires of our industry in any way, shape, or form. We're just constantly just cranking stuff out while our military's doing its thing. That kind of feels how a save game should feel like. The epic grand scale of this is truly, truly awe-inspiring to play. Rarely have I had the opportunity to just kind of just go all out like this, really build an empire, and have just multiple army groups doing stuff while maintaining like a 30-city empire. It's really quite cathartic and amazing. Um... Now, you may be able to take the city, but that's not really what I care about. I want to be able to make sure you don't take the city. All right, we'll take the missionary. We'll sell him later. Uh, Lancer can go here, and we can do with the cannons later. You are can finally heal up, because you took a bit of a pounding. All right, you keep doing that. 
keep those rail connections going to the capital. We need all the production we can get. Move off the damn tile. I don't like you anymore. Okay, you can now... Oh, you're gonna... Let's do this first. That rail connection will be done. We do that rail connection here, and then we can move on past that. Excellent. I guess if no one's at Yang Cheng right now, I can put you in to save me some money. Let's do that. Submarines. It looks like I have nothing else to blow up right now. Yep, nothing else to blow up. So the rest of you guys are gonna go in here and become nuclear. Uh, yep. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Here, yeah, attaboy. And we're gonna pull out of the Chinese waters here and make sure we can upgrade ourselves peacefully. One, two, three. And the good thing about this is that we're taking the war with China nice and easy. We don't need to urgently upgrade all these troops. And then when we're ready, we'll turn around and be able to crush Monty off of Japan because we'll have a massive tech lead. It'll be fun. Uh, up, uh not upgrade. Uh, fortify. That's right. Heal you, heal you. Cav, you have two movement. Yeah, we're going to hold off before we get killed. Worker's going to keep working on that railroad. Worker going to work. Uh, oh, inventory. Right. We're going to up upgrade this front a little bit because we're a little low. That's fine. And you, yeah, we're doing stuff already. That's good. My right, Piazza Grad is almost connected, which is awesome. I love to see that. Lancer. Yeah, we're out of movement, so we'll see what happens. Yeah, I'm, I'm still... If I were a bet man, I'd say that city gets retaken. That's what I would say. Unfortunately, I hate being right in occasions like that, so let's hope I'm wrong. You can go this way. Beautiful. A little more rail connections for our empire here. Yeah, this is actually going pretty quick. I'm glad I saved all these workers, so then we can reorient and make them do all the uranium. All dat uranium. Okay, you're still fine there. We'll keep that safe. All right. So, so far so good. We've taken three Chinese cities in one turn, effectively. Uh, we'll see if we can hold on to Jinyang or have to retake it, but we have enough stuff to retake, so it's no big deal. We'll just lose a relatively veteran infantry. I'd be kind of sad about that, but, you know, them's the breaks. It is war after all. Okay, I'll see you next turn. All right, so in cases like this, I hate being right. In this case, I was. Jinyang was retaken. Oh, we lost a veteran infantry, but what are you going to do? Except take the city back and make sure it doesn't happen again. That's really the lesson here. When you fail once, you succeed the next time. So Jin Yang is down. This is why Rocket Artillery are awesome. One shot and we're pretty much down. Let's get the Lancer in there. Uh, steal that from under his nose yet again. Yes, we'll annex it. Yes, it'll be useful maybe sometime in the future. But he's got very little in there now. So let's hope we actually get somewhere with it. Now, let's start mauling the rest of his military so he can't retake it, yeah? That's the plan. One cannon down. Not sure where his Lancer went. That's a little disconcerting. I think Bogota might have taken care of it. The other thing I want to do is upgrade these guys into actual rocket artillery. So let me do that real quick, because I don't need to take Jin Yang at the moment. Uh, yep, upgrade you, and upgrade you. Oh, you got promoted. Even better. Okay, so that's done. Uh, let's clean this rest of this up actually real quick. Hold on, can we do this? We can almost do this. One hit point, huh? Really? Really, one hit point. Okay. So now Jin Yang is officially secure. We don't have to worry about that anymore. We can try and kill this cavalry, which we'll likely succeed with in a second. Can we get this with a Lancer? Almost. Well, at least your Lancers are getting experience. That much is good. Uh, we have some... Hold on, let's repair this road before we need that. Now we can use artillery to kill that dude. Beautiful. So no more cav to worry about. Sexy! All right, nice. So now Hal and Jin Yang are officially in our sphere of influence we have bombers proper bombers now which are especially in tagging cities that can reach pretty much our next target but we're gonna put the bombers right up here in hall uh just to make it a little easier on ourselves bomber go here then we'll talk yes yes you need to go there we will heal we will be ready do we have proper bombers here no we need to upgrade all these guys in proper bombers now Yes, yes, yes. And then we can really continue the war against the Chinese unabated at this point. And then they're going to just melt at this rate. It'll be fun to watch. Okay, I love when things melt before my armies. It's a beautiful feeling. All right, we do need to get some roads up here, too, to connect to Jinyang. We'll, we're vaguely connected through Hal, but not quite yet. Okay, so we're going to get combustion to turn these into tanks at some point, uh, but not right now. Not a priority. Choose research. What do we just get? We got nuclear fission. All right, so we can go for mobile tactics to finish our infantry line and just get absolutely badass infantry. 
That'll take 11 turns, or we can start moving into land ships and destroyers. I kind of feel like doing that, because our cavalry's a little flimsy compared to everything else. I wouldn't mind having some land ships doing work. Let me get that technology. We'll have a little bit of spare oil for that as well. Choose production, huh? How about we start with the monument, and then we're going to queue up everything, and we'll never touch you again for the rest of the game, because you'll have a 30-thing queue. All right. So we have more stuff to upgrade here. Triple range. Beautiful. Next time is logistics. So we're going to upgrade all these guys so we can use it well against Kashgar. I don't need to push against Kashgar right away. More importantly, I want to get these guys up. It's like almost 400 gold to upgrade these. You see this? This is a 360 gold upgrade. It is expensive. Very expensive. But worth it. And this is why I saved all that money, as you can tell. Wow, that's a really crappy looking manufactory in the middle of the tundra. It's a really sad one. Uh, we're going to steal this cultural artifact from you. Thank you. Your contribution to the Soviet culture has been noted dully. Uh, all right, we'll hit you, and we'll run away, I guess. Uh, wow, I'm surprised that guy really stayed upright. This is going to be what? How many moves did this take me? This will take me two moves. One move to kill, and one move to go back. No, but then I'd be dead from the city, so that would be dumb. That would be classified as freaking stupid. Come here, come here, and then we'll talk about killing the cannon next turn. All right. Uh, we have another infantry. Yeah. What are we going to do with you? I guess we can put you out here to start threatening stuff. We're going to put you back this way. I just want to put anything near the city that's going to get me killed. There is fine for now. You I don't want at all. I don't need to spread you, so let's just remove you. Zero gold for getting rid of missionary? Really? They don't cost anything? Okay. Hey, you made the value judgment, not me, so... I'm not going to argue with you, game. Promote a unit. Oh, we got a free rocket artillery for Sirius. Awesome. Thanks, actually. That's great. Uh, what can I do with you now? I guess we'll bring you to the front. Bring you over to Yanchi. Okay. Thank you from City State, whatever that gave me. Whoever gave me that. Wow. <laughs> My English is clearly getting better the longer this episode goes on. Um, a unemployed citizen. All right. I guess you're going into a production center right there. Thank you. That'll work for me. Uh, what else we got? We got another citizen in Narbo. Beautiful. Do we have production things staffed yet? No, no, no. We're going to start cranking these out. We have a lot of things to build here. Oh, CN Tower, Apollo Program, Sydney Opera House. Ah, oh, that's right. We need the Sydney Opera House to be built somewhere. Is Kharkov anywhere near building this damn thing? Like, how good are we on production here? Sydney Opera House in 15. That's pretty slow. Uh, could we do it in Narbo faster? 18. So that may be our best production coastal city. Is that Hema? Would a Hema be better? 11. Yes, it would. All right. Let's get Sydney Opera House out first. Probably before the airport, actually. Then we need to get the CN Tower somewhere. We don't have any more great engineers to burn, so... Could Piedergrad do this? Oh, we were doing the airports right now, but Piedergrad is really good production. What is the next best production city after our capital? By production. Uh, other way. There we go. Young oh, Yang Cheng is huge. Okay, Yang Cheng is going to build the CN Tower for us. Hey, buddy. 11 turns. Yeah, give me some of that. Let's prioritize that over the airport for now. And look at Yang Cheng's our last growth, too, isn't it? Yes, it is. I just noticed an extra person there being like, Hey, feed me! Uh, let's put you right there. I know we need a little bit of production, but it's not going to change the CN Tower much. And it'll get us a new citizen sooner. Uh, we're right there. That works. And now we'll slow the, start the slow, arduous task of upgrading all our Gatling guns into machine guns and then bazookas. Because God knows that's what we lotteried into at this point. All right. So now, finally, Jinyang is ours and is a completely miserable city at this point. But at least it'll be out of resistance soon. That's nice. Come up this way, and we'll start heading back this way. We're going to have to start setting up against Monty shortly. Because he's still surrounding Yang, and I want to make sure I can take that down very quickly. Indeed. All right. I don't need to really watch for the Chinese anymore. We're, we're done here. The submarine corps has done its job by obliterating everything we need to worry about. All right. Uh, what can we do here? You are not quite in range for anything, so set up there for now. You're fine here. Yeah, whatever. The gats aren't going to be able to do too much, or rather, Vilnius won't be able to do too much to these gats, so let's just set up there for now. Let's scare them a little. Lancer. Yeah, how about we move here for now, and then we'll see what we can do. I oh, can still move. Go back on the road. <laughs> I have nothing better to do with that guy at this point. All right, set you up there. Good. What is this? So you can host. Yeah, I know. 11 turns to the vote. Okay, so we still have a little bit of time before the National National Games hits. Uh, plotting against Ahoy Etu. BT dubs. He's plotting against you. 
Uh, Cotton for Monty ended, dies to end not to MGBT and Jade to Monty. So let's renew that Monty trade. Wouldn't hurt. Hey, quote unquote friend. Thank you. Cool. And we had Enatum giving us something too. Where are you, buddy? Who loves ya? Uh, no, seriously, where is he? There he is. Oh, guys, really way down there. I thought he was a little better off than that. Okay. 276. That works for me. And maybe three if we're lucky. I doubt it, though. Yeah, it's going to be two. Really? You're going to go down to one. Whatever. I want flat gold. I don't really care. It'd probably be optimized if I take the GPT, but yeah. Who can be bothered right now? We're making 607, so we're doing okay. All right. Archaeologist. That warrior is still stubborn, but I'll be there until he moves off it. Then I'll get another artifact for my very own. Let's go here and piss off Kashgar a little bit. This will be two movement. Yep. Pillage and come back. <laughs> I pillage your lumber mill. Neener, neener, neener. Infantry. Uh, what were we doing with you? We're moving to the front probably, right? Yeah, let's just move you to the front. No sense keeping you back. Get you active and involved in this war making. All right, you are fine now. We can kind of cover this with this feller. And that should be about it. Can you upgrade? You can upgrade, actually. Let me get you upgraded just a little bit. And get one machine gun up here. God, it's going to be expensive. They're going to be able to two of these a turn. I have so many gats. So many gats. So little time. All right, so we recaptured Jin Yang. That's done. That's done. That's done. Someone denounced the Tang. And Monty made peace with Vilnius. All right, I think I'm going to call it there, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in to this episode. We are continuing on the conquest. We now have rocket artillery, so this conquest should be that much faster with the ridiculous amount of artillery pressure we'll be able to put out. We will take this and pup... Uh, no, we're going to annex this? No, we're going to puppet it. Right, we're going to puppet it. Annex Pinyang, annex Jiquan Chi, annex Yueyang for the aluminum and the uranium. And then we're going to liberate all these Khanat cities and then leave the Chinese right down there. Or we honestly may not liberate the Khanat cities and just leave the Chinese up there. I don't particularly give a crap. I may liberate Nadim just to make this a little easier and get a little bit of rep with, with the Khan. But the rest, I think, was leave the Chinese to fight off the Khan in the frozen north. It might, honestly, might not be worth my time. Uh, depends how much I need to get a liberation bonus, but I think with Nottingham I should be fine. Alrighty, so that is the plan going forward. I have a nurse. I will see you all next time. We continue the journey through the ages, and now the science is really kicking in. Our high tech is going, and we have a good pace to knock down Monty in the next war to come. Until that time. Till then. <laughs>